Alright, Ben S on twelve eighty seven back in with Eugene and this time it's time for game ninety four a body with squares for the NES. You fool! <laughs> yeah, that one. So far we're at four hundred eighty-four thousand ten dollars. There we go. So it's Aubrey, Wobo, Eugene, Jap, and our center square, Jay York. Here we go. We're all familiar with the story of Robinson Crusoe, who was shipwrecked and stranded on a desert island. Did he ever go back to England? Yeah, but his wife rented out his room. No. Disagree. He did. Fashion experts tell us if you go on showing up the chic design the labels on your clothes, is it really a sign of what? You're the corporate bitch. Limited <laughs> funds. Weakness on music. You fool! <laughs> that would be that. <laughs> oh. They told me not. It's a flower that girls primarily wear. <laughs> oh, girls grow carrots. In low depth areas of the central and eastern U.S. And that is that one. Round two. Secret square is hiding. At the most traditional Chinese meal, what is the very last thing you get? The check. Uh, ice cream and a fortune cookie. You fool! <laughs> soup. Back to Jay. Who is the personality most closely associated with the Pole Witch's ornament? Knack. Ben Spenden, are you Ben Franklin? Pat Nixon. Franklin. <laughs> Good grief. And that was a setup for a secret square. <laughs> me. No. At least I mouthed it, but I didn't say it because I did end with me, by the way. Because you know I didn't want to say it. A study among Eskimos in Greenland who eat a lot of fish so a considerably lower incidence in what? Getting the date. Heart disease. You, you fool! That is heart disease. And I eat fish. Lie on your back, elevate your feet, and place a wine bottle cork between your upper and lower teeth. According to Glamour magazine, why would someone do that? Do this. They're too lazy. <laughs> too really tensions, and I agree. King two. An experienced spelunker will always explore in groups, but will never take anything. What do spelunkers explore? Caves. Ancient tombs. She got it right for once. Is it ever a good idea to put vodka on your eyeglasses? Huh. Unless you're having with the dreams about Gordon. Ah, otherwise, yeah. Only if you can't find your mouth. For cleaning. Wow. That is something we learn every day. According to Consumer Product Safety Commission, if you do not know the correct wattage for a light fixer, use a bulb no larger than... your head. 
60 watts. You fool! 60 watts is dead on, by the way. What's this part? What's that popular spectator event in which divers keep ramming? Divers? Divers keep ramming their old stars? Hang on. Hang on. Hold on. Wait, wait a minute. Good grief. What's that popular spectator event in which drivers keep ramming their old cars into each other? Demolition Derby, come on, give us a win. Jesus Christ, I can't talk. What the f? Ay, ay, ay. Okay. Say it's about the 20th. I don't know why I ever had this freaking thought. Key to coffee. Because the 23rd. If. Hi, Jeff. If key to coffee is it, I'm gonna drop. We know a couple of celebrities have a birthday on the 23rd of this month. Oh, there you go. My voice cracked, I went solo. <laughs> and those two celebrities are the ones I met, and they've appeared on Celebrity Wheel of Fortune. Says. Boy, yeah. Eugene, you know what's ironic next to the liquor store that had the Comic Con poster on it? Oh boy. Oh. That had that had Shatner at the top of the thing headlining the event. I looked over and, and there was there was like this I, I can't remember what kind of clinic it is. Maybe I can look at it real quick. Uh, uh, it, it was it was like an audio clinic for like like hearing aids and stuff like that, and there was a poster on it, just raving about it. And the spokesperson was Shatner. Wow! And I was like, my God, he's everywhere. <laughs> even though, uh, even though I already saw a Decay lecture back in 2016, hopefully I can make it to this fall. Yeah, you're, you've got celebrities visiting you this autumn. That's crazy. Uh, yeah. Arkansas, of all places. Right. <laughs> I don't know if you saw Ben, but Ringo Starr is going to be in Little Rock, and I might <laughs> I know. have to. I might have to miss it because it's it's there's like this one and a half month. No, not quite one and a half. Two month period where Arkansas Comic Con with Shatner is happening, and then the day before Halloween is Wheel of Fortune live in Conway, and. Uh, about a week after that, I'm gonna be in Los Angeles with the uh, what's left of the Abix Bros. Oh, so, Super uh, Nintendo yeah. Land and Price. Mm hmm. So, yeah, it's gonna be hectic. 
talk about two of the cast members from the Adams Family and Adams Family Values movies coming this summer. So that's what two thousand cahoots. <laughs> Yeah, four hundred eighty six thousand ten dollars. Like to thank the guys for being perfect. Thank you all for watching. See you all next video soon. Mm.